What is going on guys? Coming at you here with a four package mail day video on a Friday. Not a day I normally upload, but I wanted to get this up as the final two packages that I have been waiting for to do the top 15 eBay purchases of 2021 video and the top 15 private dealings of 2021 video. Those last two packages have finally arrived. Those are the last two packages here today. And I wanted to get this up. And uh, on Sunday will be the top 15 eBay purchases of 2021 video with the private dealings top 15 video to come next Sunday. So let's get into this four card or four package mail day video. There's two cards in that second last package. So four packages. Let's get into it. Actually, I think this is just going to easily rip up. This uh, first package was an eBay purchase, but uh, it is not going to make my top 15 eBay purchases video. We've got a Young Guns exclusives number 98 of 100 Alex Chason graded PSA 10. It's been uh, a little while since I've picked up something for my Alex Chase on PC, but uh, this is a nice one. Pick this up uh, the, uh, near the end of December, I believe, but uh, yeah, not making the top 15 video. Alex Chase on UD exclusives Young Guns PSA 10. There we go. And uh, the second package, actually the second package has two cards in it as well. So six cards today. This second package here, um, just uh, a little bit of a, of a rant uh, to inform some, I'm gonna uh, say lazy American sellers. There are two cards in here. Uh, this seller was from the States he would not ship to Canada. For whatever reason, he would ship everything to Canada except hockey cards, which makes absolutely no sense. Would not ship hockey cards to Canada. I've become aware of these two cards being listed on eBay and uh, not being able to see them on my eBay, but uh, I was made aware of them. But uh, I had a friend in the US pick them up for me as uh, I was talking to him about them and he said he'd do it. And uh, the reason why I say uh, American sellers don't be lazy and ship your cards to Canada is I got these cards from my buddy for like half price and I added more to, uh, like I, I paid my friend for picking them up so uh, these cards usually sell around a hundred bucks Canadian. He picked them up for like 40 bucks Canadian and I paid him 50. So um, the original seller got uh, less than half the money he would have got if he wasn't lazy and would just ship to Canada because I could almost guarantee you that if uh, Canadians would have been uh, able to see the listing, that auction would have went for what these cards usually sell for. So just, uh, that's my little bit of a rant there. Buddy really packed these well. I 
just uh, I'm trying to be careful because I know uh, both of our addresses are on the other side of that pink bubble mailer and uh, I'm not too sure if they're written on this one as well and uh, I don't want to reveal either one of our addresses so there we go yes my buddy packed these very well Blockers. And actually, what uh, what my buddy might have done is just uh, the envelope he got it in, um, throwing it inside another envelope, and uh, not even opening them himself. So. There we have it. We have two Colton Pareko Future Watch patches. We've got number 26 of 103 color and number 37 of 103 color. The uh, original seller actually found out had uh, five of these and uh, had already auctioned off three of them uh, before I'd become aware of uh, him having them up. Again, since he wouldn't ship to Canada, I uh, couldn't see them on my eBay. So uh, yeah, that was kind of frustrating because I would have bought all five of them had, uh, had he been willing to ship to Canada. And uh, they would have went uh, they likely would have went for uh, what they're worth. They are about a hundred bucks Canadian. I uh, picked them up for about fifty bucks each, and uh, that was giving a little bit of uh, money to my friend who had to pick them up for me. But uh, we are on to the two packages now that I have been waiting for to do those top fifteen videos of twenty twenty one. So. These final uh, two packages do have really big cards in them. And, uh, I want to uh, reveal this uh, back one first, so. I'm going to use this cardboard here. Cover up the first one. All right. Um, there, that works. So uh, the first card, this package actually, uh, the uh, cards I'm looking for video that I posted in December, a guy commented and said he had these cards and uh, we ended up making a deal. So the first one, we've got a UD high gloss number four of 100 Riley Barber. Riley Barber, UD high gloss young guns. Happy to have that, but uh, I was more looking for this one. I was actually looking for this card. Uh, have not found one before. This is the first one I've seen, so uh, super stoked to finally add this one to my PC. We've got a UD High Gloss Young Guns 3 of 10 Nathan Walker. 
have five of the ten Christian Juice Young Gun High Glosses. This is my first Barber and my first Nathan Walker. Super stoked to uh, finally have found a high gloss Young Guns Nathan Walker. I'm going to uh, there we go and final package this is another card that uh, i am super stoked to finally have in my collection and this is a big one we've got A Young Guns High Gloss 4 of 10 Colton Pareko. I have four exclusives and uh, super stoked to have finally been able to pick up a high gloss for the PC. Colton Pareko. Young Guns High Gloss. Oh, those are the last two packages I have been waiting for for uh, my planned top 15 eBay, uh, eBay purchases and private dealings, uh, buys, uh, deals of 2021 videos. So Again, eBay purchases will be up on Sunday with the private dealings to follow next Sunday. I do have uh, three more really big cards coming in the mail that uh, just picked up in the last few days. So uh, i going to have another monster mail day video coming up here soon. But uh, that's going to do it here for today super stoked on this uh on this mail day three high gloss young guns before this my only uh, high gloss young guns were my five christian juice so uh super stoked to have those and uh psa 10 exclusives chase on and uh man i wish i would have been able to get all five of the pareko future watch patches that uh that seller was auctioning but uh yeah American sellers, do not be lazy. Ship to Canada. The market for hockey cards is in Canada. Your cards are going to sell for a fraction of the price when you exclude Canadians being able to buy your uh, your cards. Just a uh, bit of a lesson there. Um, leave me on that but uh it's going to do it here for uh, a very special friday mail day video folks if you did enjoy this mail day video feel free to leave a like comment below and uh if you've not yet hit the subscribe button make sure you do so we got plenty more box breaks matthews or mcdavid's six pack saturdays sunday uploads and uh, maybe even some of these uh, super special uh, non never upload day videos like this on a Friday when I want to get a video up so plenty of content to look forward to folks thanks for tuning in to uh, what was a really really good mail day